In the underground engineering industry, the excavation with hydromill equipment has allowed us to overcome the limitations imposed by the diaphragm technology, especially by correcting in progress any deviation from the vertical line. However, to date it's been impossible to drill panels and subsequently to carry out the work required over 120 meter depth. We tackled the new challenge using a hydromill machine at 250 meters depth, which had never been done before. This is more than an achievement towards which we're striving. It's an investment in professionalism, commitment, experience, in order to expand the field of possible applications. It was a great all-round teamwork starting from the technical department, prototype assembly, testing. Everyone contributed to this outstanding result. The equipment under examination included two soil mech hydromill units in the Tiger version with hydraulic and mud winders positioned on the base carrier. The challenge within the challenge was to combine the size and depth of excavation, as well as controlling the mill during the excavation. It would not have been enough to test a new hydromill machine designed to reach unthinkable depths just by using factory tests. What we needed was definite confirmation for the solutions and technologies adopted. This is why fairly accurate tests were conducted. The area where we carried out the test had been carefully selected. In fact, we took into account geological variety to test the equipment as accurately as possible. Through continuous coring down to a depth of 250 meters, we found an area whose stratigraphy shows an overwhelming percentage of rock due to the hydromill machine ability to keep a minimum distance from the vertical line and to the possibility of rapidly drilling through rock layers. Thanks to DMS, drilling mate system, the operator can monitor directly from the booth the parameters for the excavation in progress, thus rapidly intervening to correct any deviations between the vertically required by the project and the actual value. All collected data are sent to the control room center where accurate reports are processed. Furthermore, DMS checks in real time the work done by soil mech machines all over the world to prevent problems or to react as soon as any malfunctioning occurs. Soil mech hydromill modules SH30, SH40 and SH50 have been designed with a very precise purpose in mind, ensuring that all project specifications are met in terms of inclination, rotation and twisting. In order to achieve this result, soil mech hydromill machine modules are based on two action concepts. Firstly, they exploit the thrust principle to use the side and front flaps placed longitudinally across the frame independently one from the other. Secondly, they make effective use of innovative technology with the two cutting units designed to operate separately and at different angles. The versatility of cutting units combined with the flaps action thus makes it possible to change the module inclination on the three axes, maintaining the required vertical line. The important results just obtained will provide new solutions for geoengineering problems. Yeah.